Good 3.30 in the afternoon to you guys. <laughs> I am starting off this vlog hella late. Basically, I just did not have any motivation to pick up the camera at all from the time I woke up until now. So, here I am, starting my day, wearing purple sunglasses because it is super bright outside and it's really nice. Um, my heel bruise is like at the point now where like the skin is not as soft and mushy now and it's like just sore. It, it honestly feels like sunburn. It, it's kind of weird, like honestly, it's, it's a really weird sensation, feeling thing. Anyways, I'm going to be heading out a little bit later on. I'm going to get some cool time lapse stuff. It'll be a little darker, so it might look pretty cool. Um, kind of like blurry, blurry lights and stuff. I love these purple glasses, so thumbs up for that. But anyways, today is going to be kind of a day where I just take this time and get cut up on like personal stuff, like um, stuff I kind of have to focus on for real life. Um, there's a big change coming up in a, in a few months, like like probably like just about less than a year now that I have to prepare for and there's a lot of work going into it. I don't want to give you guys too much information. Let's just know, just know it's going to be cool and these vlogs are going to change and there's going to be some new people that you are going to meet that I'm excited for. So, I mean, if you guys like watch my Minecraft channel, then you, you know about Eric, um, Mr. G-Stuff and stuff like that, but there'll be two others that you will be meeting. Hopefully, that's the plan anyway. We just got to figure all this stuff out as a group of friends which is not very easy because we all have very different opinions and it's 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 a big change it's a big move um but yeah um, i think it's all gonna work out and i have to be prepared i have to really kind of like buckle down and get ready for september if i'm going back to pennsylvania as far as i know i am and then i wasn't then i was then i wasn't then i was then i wasn't oh now i am again there's just so much stuff going on um, I might record a Minecraft video today to have it scheduled for tomorrow because I don't really want to go two days without a video because tonight I have to go to bed super early, tomorrow I have to wake up super early, work all day, and I'm going to come home, I'm going to be tired and too tired to record, so I'm thinking about recording tonight and scheduling for an upload to tomorrow, so yeah. But I'm going to go get a shower because I talk way too freaking much. See you guys in a second. But that, that's my batteries. Here we go. I wanted to talk to you guys real quick, and... It's something that I feel is a very serious discussion and that we should honestly have because yesterday something was said to me and to a group of friends, Willard being one of them and Lacey being another one, she joined the party later, but she wasn't there when this was initially said. There is a 13 year old boy in Scotland who is a big fan of my Minecraft channel and has been for a long time and about a month ago. He was able to get into a party with me, and we talked, and we played video games with, like together, and it was just awesome. And last night he was being bullied very badly by these kids that were threatening to get all his information and release it to have his family hunted down, and, and the stuff they were saying were was terrible, and I heard it with my own two ears. I took the opportunity to stand up for him and to be there for him and to explain to him that what they were doing they couldn't do anyway and that it was a scare tactic and that they were just trying to scare him because they were young kids and I don't think they really knew you know like you know how it is young kids on the internet like I'll have you hacked blah 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 like you know it, it, it he doesn't understand only being 13 years old of course he's not gonna understand after it was all said and done and we got him calmed down he said something to me that made me realize how much power YouTubers or content creators can honestly hold and the changes that we can make with somebody's life. It's it's crazy. Danny told Willard and I, and this was the most sincere thing I've ever heard come out of anybody's mouth, and he said, you know, I've only known you guys for about a month. And I just want to say you are the best group of people that I've ever met in my life, and I'm only 13 years old. That's incredible. And I just want you guys to know that you can be the difference in somebody's life, and if you have that opportunity, be the difference. Because honestly, it is such a good feeling. I just wanted to get that off my chest. I'll see you guys soon. I showered. I ate. It is super windy outside. Now it is time to go ahead and pre-record the Minecraft video, which is going to be up tomorrow while I'm at work. Alright, I know I said I was going to go out and get some time lapse and stuff like that at night. I decided to hang back because I wanted to elaborate a little bit more on what I talked about earlier. 
I told you a story about how a 13-year-old boy that was a fan of mine came to me and my group of friends and said that we were the nicest people he's ever talked to. We were the greatest people he's ever talked to. Like, because we helped him, because we were there for him, because when he had nobody else, we were there. We played games with him. Something so small, a gesture so small and so kind can go such a long way with somebody. And I highly encourage it. Like, if you guys have friends or... If you are a content creator yourself and you have people that look up to you, reach out to them. Talk to them. If someone contacts you, don't just give them one and two word answers. Have a conversation. So much, like, like something so simple, just by playing a game with him for a half hour, literally completely, like, changed the way that he, you know, he, like, it just changed his day. It just made his mood so much better. And that's what I'm saying, like, such a small gesture. You know, like, there's been times where I've responded to people's comments or, like, added people back on Xbox or, like, have conversations with people because I know that can go such a long way to somebody. Now, I know not everybody struggles with certain issues, but a lot of people do. And, you know, you can be that change in somebody's life. You can be that difference. It may not even change their life, but if you can just make their day even just the tiniest bit better, you've accomplish something so amazing and to me there is nothing more gratifying than knowing that I've potentially made somebody's day better or even changed somebody's life. I've had people come to me and told me that I changed their lives all because I opened up about my depression and I was honest with people and I help people. People have went and reached out to other people and have gotten help and have put themselves on the road to a much better life because of me. No amount of money, no amount of views, no amount of subscribers, nothing, nothing in this world will ever compare to that feeling. Someone could hand me ten million dollars right now, but the gratitude would be nothing like the gratitude I feel when I know that I've made somebody's day better. There's people driving by really, so it's really creepy. <laughs> but honestly, if through these videos, through these vlogs that I know aren't that exciting, if I can just make somebody smile, make somebody laugh, or have someone watching this leave with just a little bit of information that could that they could think about and sit on and and potentially make their life better in the future. Like that quote that I end everything with. I have people tell me all the time they love that quote because it's deep. That's it, I've accomplished a goal. Literally if one of you watching this video cracked a smile, laughed, or even Watching this made your day just a tiny bit better. I've accomplished a goal. I've done my job. And to me, that is amazing. And that's what I'm saying, guys. Honestly, if anybody ever comes to you with a problem, never turn them away. Because you, you can make the difference. Walking down the street, just as simple as walking down the street and passing somebody on the sidewalk and smiling at them. Waving, saying, hi, how are you? How's your day? Simple conversations can go such a long way. Or simple gestures is what I'm trying to say. It's incredible the power that we hold as people that we just don't realize. It's like it's like we, we don't realize how much of an influence we can have on people. And, I mean, it's crazy. I never thought being a freaking... What was I? When, when I? when I started YouTube when I was, like, 19. I'm 23 now. When I was 19. 18. I think I was 18. I was 18 going on 19. I started YouTube. Never in a million years did I ever think I would change somebody's life or inspire somebody to do something or even make somebody's day better. Somebody that didn't know me. Somebody that just knew me as an internet personality. It's crazy. Like, when, when people say, like, we as people can change the way things happen, that is true. You just have to find it within yourself. And it's not something that can just happen overnight. It's something that takes time. But, like, really, guys, we harness this power that is just truly amazing. And if you really think about it, seriously, you can change somebody's life. If not one person, but many people. I just encourage you to, to just be there for somebody and just be a nice, kind person no matter what. Because, really, it does go such a long way. But that's enough ranting. That is enough rambling. I am going to end the video here because I have to be up really early in the morning. I still have stuff I gotta take care of. And yeah, so I know today was kind of weird and it was me like talking a lot and like, ranting, but I was just inspired. 
Danny inspired me to make this video, or not really to make the video, I was going to make the video anyway, but to talk about what I talked about in this video. And I'm going to title this video, Be the Change, because you can be the change, and I encourage it. But, guys, remember, if you're going through it, and you're having a bad day, that it is just a bad day. It is not a bad life. Keep that in mind. Keep fighting. My sunglasses are pretty freaking cool, and I'm going to wear them to work tomorrow. See ya!